Hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel and to the next part of snowy escape so obviously the background's a little different because we are back home at evergreen harbor just to visit the family a little bit because ivy been getting a lot of calls from her grandparents and her parents also her brother about coming back to visit and just to see them so she made a quick trip to evergreen harbor if you have not seen our eco lifestyle let's play then obviously this might not look familiar to you but this is the house that we played in um it was a really big lot everything was designed by me i'm not much of a builder so please don't judge but she brought some onigiri to share with everyone because she wanted to bring some of the japanese culture home he's like everyone come try my onigiri that i made this is everyone i'm sorry for grandpa not to have a seat but just catching up with the family it's so weird seeing everyone back but i think we're gonna head out because it's already the afternoon late afternoon everyone got to see her so they can kind of leave her alone a little bit and she can kind of go about her day okay guys so we are back home so some things have changed not in the house but in general because i feel like in the last part i didn't know what we were supposed to be doing or anything she has actually joined the salary person career she's actually level three i played a little bit off camera just to get ahead so she's level three she's a competent cleric because I was like, one, we need money. Well, at the time we needed money, we have saved up quite a bit and we made some money. Also, she actually has her friend here. I forgot she was here low key. Uh, Kiko Godo. She made friends with her at work. They actually went for a hike prior to her going to her fr um, family's home. So that's why she's kind of still here. We also made friends with Jenna in the last part. We actually gave her a slight makeover. I did film it, so I think I'm going to post that cast video soon. She also made another friend at work, Katashi Nakajima. So she's been getting close with him too, and obviously Akiko Goto. So those are her two really close friends, and also Jenna. It's a Saturday night, so I wonder what we should do. Uh, maybe we should go to the bar with our friends. Obviously, I just made Akiko leave. But what if we go to the bar with our friends and see how that goes? This is obviously Katashi. So that's him. He's really cute. He He's obviously from the area and they just got acquainted because they were working on the same project together at work. Obviously Akiko who's also a native of Mount Komorebi. The only person that's really foreign here is obviously Ivy but that's fine. They have accepted her with open arms. So let's order drinks for the group. Um, maybe we should get... I don't want them to get too buzzed. Maybe this. It's a little expensive, but you know, treat your co-workers. Oh, look at you, Katashi! You're getting it! What? Ooh! So let's just talk to everyone, see how they're doing. Obviously, they've been working really hard. The only person that has that doesn't work at the corporation that everyone else works at is Jenna. Jenna works somewhere else. We're all good friends. They all started working at the same project together. That's how they really met each other. Kind of happy that Ivy has like a good group of friends that you know she can like really rely on and count on. Um, we haven't been able to snowboard or ski since the last part because working has been str like a struggle. Like it's literally all day, every day. Like she's working. So Katashi really wants to dance. We can all dance together if you want. Yes, <laughs> Ivy has acquired the dance skill. Look at them, they're just dancing at the bar. <laughs> oh, she's dazed. Ooh, angry drunk. Oh no. Well, it's already 9.51, so I don't know what else we can do. We can probably just head home, especially since she got drunk. Probably shouldn't do anything. But, you know, maybe I should do something. A little bit of a flirt. Because, you know, she had a little too many things, um, too much to drink. So, you know, she maybe flirt a little bit. But I think we should probably head home. It's already 10 p.m. Okay, so we just got home. We should probably put her to bed. Don't put some pa don't put makeup on. <laughs> uh, we can just go straight to bed, even though she's not extremely tired. Maybe we can actually get some stuff done now because she's not that tired. Even though she's drunk, we can prepare some semi-important reports. Hopefully she does not mess it up. Oh, she's a little angry. Okay, let's speed this up. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, good morning, guys. So it's Sunday morning, 8 a.m. Bright and early. We're probably gonna take a quick shower, even though she doesn't really need to. You know, just to get her skills, um, her needs all the way up. Probably gonna grab some leftovers because she is starving from last night. You know, she had a long night with her friends and stuff, which is nice, but you know. Um, so we did the semi-important reports last night when she got home. 
She still needs to reach level 3 of logic and level 3 of writing, but I'm not 100% fixated on that right now. I kind of want to go to the mountains because we have not done that in a while. Like, I played at least a week off camera, so we have not gone, gone skiing or anything like that. So, we're just gonna eat this real quick, then we're gonna head to the mountain because I think she should work on skiing and skateboarding because I feel like that's one of the main things you can do in this pack. Okay, so we are here. It is below freezing here. Oh, wow. Okay, so where's the bunny slopes? Oh, right here. Perfect. We can sled down the bunny slope with... Katashi. Oh, that would be so cute if they do that. Ooh. Ooh, so... Oh, no! <laughs> they fell! Oh, dang! Oh, so I feel like they're getting close this way because obviously they didn't really know each other that well, but, you know, hanging out with each other outside of work really does help you get to know people. So I think that's great. Ooh, they did a little swerve. Oh, they made it this time! Yay! <laughs> Yay. Maybe we can go to the onsen. Yes. Yes, yes. And they could probably just get to know each other in here. I think that's cute. I wish they had another hot spring. Watch him sing, I guess. Cheer. They're probably just talking, uh, talking about the project that they're both working on that they need to get done. He probably doesn't want to talk about work, honestly. He's probably like, let's just talk about us. Maybe flirt a little bit. Acts if single. Like I said, I didn't plan on them to be dating or whatever, but you know, <laughs> it's right there, you know? So we might as well compliment his appearance a little bit, see if he likes it, deep connection. Oh, a sentiment gain! You're so fun to be around. I really enjoy spending time with you, and I hope you feel the same way about me. Oh my god, we got a sentiment with him! Closer from Happy Memories. Oh my god, that's the same thing that we had with Jenna. But it's already 3 in the afternoon, so we should probably head home soon. Because I do want her to start working on some stuff for work. Okay, so we just got home. I think I'm gonna work on some of her writing skill right now. What is- what is she doing? Um, lifestyle. Ooh, people person in progress. Ooh. What does this mean? Sims living a people person lifestyle have an easier time building and maintaining large friend groups. Sometimes at the cost of connecting with those friends. To acquire or maintain this lifestyle, a friend should have- a sim should have four or more friends. Oh. Lifestyle effect. Keep lower relationship level friends easier, but struggle to keep good friends at or higher. Various benefits when interacting with three or more friends at a time or when making a new friend. Less likely to gain long-term sentiments with friends. Gre greater need to be social. Tense when friend group is fewer than four. Hopefully we don't kind of get this. I kind of want to be more outdoorsy. So, <laughs> we probably should go on a hike. That's another thing I really wanted to do, is go on a hike. I think we're almost at level 3 of writing. Yes, we are. And after that, I think we're going to go on another hike. Let's hike the scenic loop. But we're going to hike just for a little bit. Then, we'll call it a night. But after her hike, I think... We're just gonna go eat. We're gonna go home and eat. Then she's gonna get ready to go to bed. So we are up early in the morning for work. I feel like every single time she goes to work, she's up really early for some reason. So we're gonna use the bathroom. We're gonna take a quick shower. Then we're gonna come down here and grab some breakfast. Miko is up bright and early. Oops, she went under the couch. So based on what I've seen so far, playing with the salary person career so not every day they work really late but involuntarily they will work at like until like 9 p.m even though it says 7 p.m so i th thought that was interesting that they will automatically work overtime if they really want to so i feel like that kind of messes with her sleep and obviously when she goes to work she's not having the most fun she's really like sad and stuff when she comes home sadly but yeah She's gonna have to work on her logic skill, and I feel like her logic skill goes up really fast when she does the semi-important reports. So she's just gonna eat, and after that, we're just gonna maybe work on our logic skill a little more. Maybe if we work on more semi-important reports, even though we don't have to, but we're going to anyway, because she's not gonna leave until 9, so we have so much time. Miko! Miko! Um, our girl's about to head off to work, so I kind of wanted to show you her, like, uniform, so I'm really excited about this. <laughs> Look at how cute she looks. She had to take off her piercings for work, but girl, you look so good. 
as a career woman, even though it literally takes literally every energy out of her. But she's about to go to work. Oh my god, Katashi, we should hang out more. I have a lot to talk about these days. Are you cool with that? Yeah. The long hours staring at the acquisition forms have really inspired Ivy Olivia. She has come up with a revolutionary idea on using AI to auto-accept terms of service prompts when installing apps. This will save the company minutes of time each year. Will Ivy risk standing up from the crowd and promote her idea? Yeah, I think she would. Ivy risk it and the idea is overwhelmingly popular. Ivy Olivia's employee performance rating has gone from sufficient to acceptable. Wow. <laughs> oh, she did not work late today, but you can see her needs. Oh, her needs are actually not as bad as they usually are. They're actually pretty good. Usually it's awful. Um, we could probably cook something. Maybe not onigiri because I feel like that's all we make. Oh, Katashi was wondering if you wanted to go over her ha his house and hang out. Okay, sure. I know we're tired, but like, okay, <laughs> yeah. They probably talked at work and stuff and now he wants to see her. Maybe she should change out of her work uniform, because he did. Maybe if they can just sit together and chat. Um, maybe they can flirt a little bit? Attempt to swoon? I don't know what that means. Ask about relationship? What's, what's that? I don't think I've ever seen that interaction before to ask about relationships. Whisper sweet nothings, kind of tickle it, um, tickle mercilessly. Ooh, I'm very happy with you, Ivy Olivia. Oh! Oh, sh- Oh, he didn't like it. Oh, he didn't like it. He didn't like it. Oh. Oh, no. He, he. Okay, we went too far. We're tired. We shouldn't do all that. Let's just keep it professional and friends. I thought he wanted to be, like, more than friends, obviously, but oops. No, I thought... Okay, so let's just keep it as friends. Ivy, you just went a little too far. You were a little tired. Oh, he doesn't like us. Let's just show appreciation. Say thank you for inviting us. You didn't have to. I just read the situation wrong. Like, I'm sorry. And he's just like, it's fine. No, it's fine. I just wanted to hang out. <laughs> I think we're going to head out. Because it got really awkward very fast. So we're just going to head out. Oh, she passed out. Oh, gosh. So, it's the morning, and she woke up a little bit late, because it's literally 8.23, so hopefully she doesn't completely die before work. Oh, and our bills have been shut off. Great. So, honestly, I think this is a good time to end the part. Our power shut off. Katashi has sent mixed signals, making it seem like he wanted to be with us, and obviously he's like, no, I don't. So, Ivy's just going to be doing her for a little bit and see how things go. I might play a little bit off camera. I don't know yet. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.